Hi guys, today we are going to do um, some marbling and practice some marbling on paper and um, it's part of our topic work for um, this year. So all I've got, just found myself an old tray, you can use an old baking tray or um, something if you put some scrap paper in it um, or it, this is just an old one that I've just kept just for painting and that sort of use. So all I've got, these are some paints that I've just picked up out of Wilco's, just ready-made poster paints. So all you're going to do is I'm just going to squirt. I might take the lid off, I might take the top off. Can I take the top off? Yeah. So I'm just going to squirt a little bit in there. And I've got a couple of other colours. So I'm just going to do that's pink. And I've got, see, I just look out for some of these when they're on offer. So you can see they're half price. It's only 50p. So sometimes when you go into some of these shops, they do put them on half price. So always on the lookout for a bargain. Right. So I've just put this paint now, so I've put my paper nearby. The next thing we're going to need is some balls. Now these are old um, ball pit balls that I've still got around the house. Um, so you can use them. Um, if you haven't got something like that, you can use an old golf ball or anything you've got maybe lying around the garden that's not got, gone a bit yucky. Just give it a quick rinse over, clean it up and you can use that. If not, I've got um, a bit of tin foil just screwed up, or a bit of paper is just as good screwed up. Okay, so you can use. Got several ideas that you can use. Okay, so I'm just going to chuck them all in. Okay, what we're going to do is then I'm going to put all the balls in the painted areas, and then what you're going to do is just roll the paint and the balls down oh that one's not going he's stuck we're just going to roll them about okay i think it's going to be better if i do a couple at a time so i'm just going to roll it down and what you're going to do is i might just have to roll this around in here a bit more um what it's going to do is um going to um make some marble effects and paint on the paint so I'm just gonna help help it out this is getting a bit stuck it's not that easy I can't twiddle it that much because of the camera so I'm just gonna roll it up and down this one really does the blue one really doesn't want to go does he yeah I'm on blue so you're just gonna roll and try and create some pattern effects so we're just gonna have a really good go Okay, so you just roll this in and then just roll it all the way down. And create some pretty patterns. And in the past, year two, I've really loved this, um, doing this. I'm creating. Oh, I've got some there. Might just have to flick it around a bit with my hand to get it going. Different textures, different balls. You can try different colours and different shades of paper. This is just the lilac paper. So you can see, let's take it out. Let's move my tray. Oh, let's move my tray out of the way. Ta -da! So now I've created, this is ball rolling. Okay, so I'm going to show you different techniques and all the different videos. So this is part one and all the different videos and different techniques of trying to create marbles. So I'm going to use some with pencil, some with paints, um, and lots of other different materials. So have a go at all the videos if you can. Um, don't have to do all of them, but try as many as you can and show me your beautiful creations for your papers. See you soon. Have fun. <laughs> 